Bobby. Liam here, and we are taking a trip down memory lane and playing this amazing, great classic game, The Simpsons Hit and Run. It's been a while since I've uh, been to Springfield. Oh, don't you just love it when you just find floating money in the air? It's Elon Musk the clown. And this one isn't poisonous to anybody that we know of. Mmm, cola. Must it buzz cola. <laughs> Oh, it's just as glorious as I remember it. All right, player one, uh, Homer. I don't need to take Homer. instructions from my stupid blonde, spiky-haired son, whose voice actor Elon could or may not be a part of Scientology. Who knows? Called. Certainly not me. Told me somebody ate every dessert in the house. What? I'm not running to the store. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Why are we so far apart? Come a bit closer to me. I promise I won't kick you. It's crashing time. It's kicking time. That's what it is. Yeah. yeah! Stranger danger. <laughs> That's your response. <laughs> she just got run over by a school bus. Oh, there goes March. Right, let's go to the store. Out of the way, wifey. <laughs> <laughs> Just call me Air Homer. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be sick of these phrases quite soon. Oh god, I've nearly got the fuzz on me. I mean, we might as well uh, get the police on us while we're doing this mission. Make it a bit more spicy, you know? The first level. This is basically how I drive in real life. Okay, let's go. We got hit and run on our first mission. No, 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 no. Oh, I got busted. God damn it. Well, there goes my hard-earned 50 coins I just made. Now I'm not gonna have any money to buy some ice cream with the pies in it, which sounds absolutely delicious, by the way, I might add. My metabolism has been slowed by frozen peas. Oh, I know how you feel. Hey, Apu, give me a cola and I need another bucket of ice cream with mini pies. What happened to the ice cream with mini pies your wife bought this morning? I probably ate it. I don't remember stuff too good. Can I kick a poo? I want to place my foot on a poo. I can't get out now. A poo's blocking the way. Get out of the way, a poo. All right, what is... Was that just Buzz Cola? How many? How much Buzz Cola did he buy? Jesus. What is, um, I've always wondered what that thing is below Marge, because it looks like she's just had breast implants or something. I know it's probably her arm and, yeah, it's probably her arm, but why did they choose that? Anyway, what do you want, Marge? Homie, Lisa left for school without her science project. Not my problem. You can drop it off on the way to work. Wait, what time and is this supposed I to be? What time does Homer work? start work? God damn you, Marge. I wonder if I can destroy S hey. Skinner's car. Skinner's car waiting around here? No. I thought it would be, but it's not. Damn, I'm trying to trick the game, but the game tricked me instead. Okay, right, let's uh, start this then. There he is. Senior Skinner. And for some reason, he's taken his mum mother to, to school with him. Well, I'm allowed to be, to be here, here, mother. It's school, school, school hours. Mother, no, I won't wear that sailor uniform. Anymore. I remember I used to struggle on this, uh, on this mission as a child. No, it's just, it's a piece of piss now. He says with uh, Skinner catching up to him. <laughs> right, now can I destroy Skinner's car? Must kill Skinner. Wee! Must kill Skinner. Wee! Oh, it's gone now. Ah, right. Time to deliver this fucking thing to goddamn child. I'll block the door. God damn it. God, I'm just being stared down by Willy holding his meat. Mom called. She says she needs to talk to you at home before you go to work. Good, how much time does this man have to throw away before going to work? Is that a mole man? Oh my god, it is! Mole man! My wrinkles hurt. <laughs> Football in the groin! I have... <laughs> oh no, that's so depressing. I love how Hans Mole Man is probably one of my favorite characters. You can say that this could be worse as GTA. The reason being, in this game you can run over little kids, in GTA you can't. Alright, let's go destroy the neighborhood. Literally, every time I see wasps, that's what I do. Just jump and kick at them. Getting paid! I totally forgot about these cards. <laughs> Look at me just, just spying in my son's room. Creepy Homer. <laughs> I feel no pain. Right, let's head over to Stupid Flanders. Is that your lord? Iron helps us play. Right, where's my goddamn wife? Oh, she's hidden inside. I kept kicking her outside. I can't even touch her in here. No touchy for Homer. Homer, go talk to Ned Flanders. Uh, you're talking to a lamp. Go outside. Okay, whatever you say, game. Hi, diddly ho, neighbor Rooney. Love thy fucking neighbor. They did their best, shoddly, iddly, iddly, diddly. Shoddly nice, hostility, diddly, diddly, diddly. In a dither, Homer. So many of my possessions have disappeared. 
I called the police to find the culprit. Culprit, eh? Oh, the police are on their way. My cooler, my lawn chair, a family portrait. Even run an inhaler. What kind of <laughs> Whoa, daddy wants to. Oh, no. So I much child's inhaler. Excuse me, I think I have to go shuck some corn. That's the excuse I use if I need to get out of things. Right, uh, where is my vehicle? I don't have a vehicle. That's right, we'll complete this mission oh, using the school bus. Please. Stop! Stop the bus! Oh god, I feel like Peter Parker in the first Spider-Man film. He's eating at us! I'm scared! <laughs> Come on, man, move this thing! I can't! It's a Gia! Oh god, why did I choose a school bus? This is the slowest piece of shit ever. I do like the accompanying music that goes with this mission. It sounds very groovy. I think everyone has that one friend who is like Barney, and I think I am that friend. <laughs> Just drunk and fat and a mess. Uh, you remember that cooler I gave you for your birthday? Well, Flanders wants it back. Now what will I use for a toilet? And that's what I do as well. Now where did I leave Rod's stupid inhaler? Duh, the dump truck. Why is it even there? I'd like to know the story behind how these things got to the places. See, I want a prequel game where we find out how did Rod's inhaler get on top of the dump truck? Wee! Now to return this stuff before the cops find me sitting around talking to myself. I mean, can they arrest you for that? I don't think they can. Oh, we got time to run Hans Molman over with a school bus before we return. There we go. I feel complete now. I feel like I can complete this mission. Hi, Ned Rooney! Where is he? <laughs> there he is. <laughs> oh, God. He just takes so much shit, doesn't he, Ned Flanders? Where's my money, Flanders? Give me my real reward. I mean, this is a good enough reward, kicking Flanders in the nuts. Hey, now that's just plain rude. You what? What did you say, Ned? Huh? <laughs> Worth it. Let the traffic take you. Okay, right, let's go back to our home. We've not even had work yet. You're late for work. Why am I late for work, Marge? Oh yeah, you've been right making me run errands all morning. Only one person can help me. Lenny. Yeah, not you. You just create problems for me, Marge. Okay, well, I'm going to have to buy the Plow King, I think, if my memory serves me correctly. So I'm just going to do that before I speak to Lenny. Thinking ahead. Barney, can I borrow the Plow King? Take what you want, sexy leprechaun. I'm gonna punch Lenny in the crotch. Now I'm taking a sick day. Hey, Homer, how about a breakfast churro? Why does no one work in this place? I wonder if Barney still has the plow king. What do you mean? You just bought it off him. Of course he still has the plow king. No, Homer's stupid, but I didn't know he was that stupid. Right, let's uh, destroy my boss's car. I should try that. That should be a thing if you're running late. Just run, just destroy your boss's car. I don't care if I'm on the timer. I need to run over Hans Mole Man. Sally Ho! Oh, I completely missed. How did I miss that? I am evil Homer. I am evil Homer. Oh, I got you, you prick. Time to kick him. Oh, he's disappeared. Right, at the nuclear plant, or as it's pronounced, nuclear. How can I sleep with that camera? Old sexy girls could be watching me on the internet. Stupid sexy Flanders! Oh god, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. That's enough work for one day. I think I remember where they all are. It's the, playing the Simpsons hit and run again, it's, it's like riding a bike. You'd sort of like really forget. You know, they really look like the workers from uh, the potion place in Shrek 2. Mindless drones, return to your ugly families. Eight hours have not passed already, Jesus. That was like two minutes. To be fair, I did come to work super late as well, because I had all those errands to run this morning. Oh, I just remembered something. There's a rocket car somewhere around here. Yes, I remember now. It's all coming back to me. I remember this car being insanely quick. I actually can't remember what episode this one's from, actually. All right, let's try and make it home without destroying the thing. Oh, never mind. <laughs> that didn't go as planned. Marge, that black van is spying on us. Oh, homie. You're so sexy when you're paranoid. Why is she getting aroused? Be more concerned that someone's spying on you and your family. Don't get horny. Yeah, let's not take that car. Can I take this car? Oh, crap. Okay, I don't think my car's going to make it the whole journey. Oh, my God, he's trying to... He's smart. Blocking my way. 
Mr. Burns is behind all this. Why am I outside my car? You know what? I want to do the rest of uh, this world dressed as uh, Homer in his underwear. So, and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to fulfill my dreams. Out of my way, daughter. Wait, why is she still in school? <laughs> I came into my, uh, my kid's school just to take my clothes off. <laughs> She's probably scarred for life. Yeah! <laughs> Just gotta do that seven more times. So I guess this answers the question, what the fuck Marge does during the day when everyone's at school? or at work, or getting on with their lives. Marge is just causing chaos and mayhem on the streets of Springfield. Must run over Hans Mole Man. <laughs> Did he just say this was the highlight of my day? He speaks the true true. Only kids would play more video games about sharing. I mean, this is a game about sharing. Sharing my foot up your whatever. Right, where am I going now? Oh, Carl. We haven't kicked Carl yet. What are you doing, ma'am? It's Carl! Mr. Burns, mini cameras, black vans. Bro, good thing I'm drunk. Stupid drunk. I can't believe I'm racing the same guy twice in one day. Oh, crap. Damn it, I dropped my Where's my car? Up. Oh, this is highly unfair. Well, I'll just grab this random car then. Ugh, oh, right. Okay, I'm pretty sure Smithers has definitely won this one. Ooh. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Oh, I can see this little blip thing. So, all might not be lost. Oh, there he is. Okay, that wasn't as hard as I thought. I remember this game being a lot harder as a child. Crap. Why did I go this way? Why am I the way that I am? Executed nicely. Oh, God. The pressure's really on now. <laughs> God, the handling of this car's so shit as well. Okay, I think I've got this. No, 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 no. Oh, it's close, it's close, it's close, it's close. Oh my god, that was very close. I've never been scared in my entire life. Oh, Mr. Burns, let's kick him. Oh, they ran him over. You're spying on Springfield with your black vans and surveillance cameras. Black vans? Hmm, aren't they connected with some sort of pizziola concern? What? They were only pizza man! Smithers, release the hounds. And if this oaf is an employee of the plant, fire him at once. We're number one! We're number Why am I one. cheering that I just got fired? That sucks. So here we are, downtown. New cars, new missions, new vehicles, and most importantly, new Simpsons characters to beat the crap out of. Including fucking Milton over here. Everything is coming up, Milhouse! God, I'm literally just like causing absolute destruction and mayhem. Fuck you, cat. Sayonara, bitch! I gotta get the new bone storm or I'll be as uncool as Millhouse. I'm standing right here, Bart. Oh god, that's hey, happened to me hey, before. Hey. I was the Millhouse in the situation. Bart. Principal Skinner's looking for everyone that skipped school today. And when you're caught, it's expulsion, Bart. Expulsion! I mean, what are you gonna do, Millhouse? You're just standing around like a lemon. It's gonna catch you for sure. That's why your name's Millhouse, and I'm Bart. Right, let's, uh, let's avoid Skinner. Woo, nice one. I'll get you, Bart. Just like I got Charlie and Nam. Uh, when he says he got Charlie and Nam, does he mean cocaine? Charlie is a slang term for cocaine in England. I swear the Simpsons family just have like some weird vendetta against Skinner. Because he's always in the fucking way. Look, his mum's in the back again. Why is she always driving with him? Jesus Christ. Mother issues. Oh my god. Right, I can't let this opportunity go to waste. There's Mole Man. Let's run him the fuck over. Worth it. I don't care if it's a uh, jeopardizes mission. Fuck me. He is driving relentlessly. I'm never gonna get away from this fucking creep. Smell you later, stinky gator. Uh, always Hello. driving away from grown men. Story of my life. Oh Jesus Christ! Looks like my fucking car's been circumcised. Grab, 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 grab. Hello, Jimbo. He looks like an ogre in that picture. Oh Jesus! <laughs> well, the police just like that's their solution. Just instead of sending me to juvie, just run me the fuck over. Fair enough. I can get behind that. Too late, losers. I got the last game. Jesus, look at the size of my head compared to his. <laughs> what the fuck? How the hell does he get bullied by him? My whole head is bigger than he is. Marge's poor vagina. <laughs> Knowing that she gave birth to this fucking meathead. I feel so sorry for her now. Anyway, let's kick Jimbo. Who's bullying who now, bitch? Right, anyway, let's proceed on. Jesus Christ, my car looks like a total pile of shite. Just looks like a beaten up wang. Oh, it's my other bully. Beat the crap out of him too. Oh, 
<laughs> He's just watching. He doesn't care. Fuck you too. Who's this? Eddie. Isn't Eddie supposed to be like um, Ralph's rule dad as well? See, I, I think personally, I agree with this theory, but... I also think that Clancy Wiggum is the mother and father as well. I think he's got a little psycho thing going on here where he's, he plays both uh, Clancy and uh, his wife, who I forgot the fucking name of. Video games are so late 90s. Illegal fireworks are all the rave now. You better make it snappy though if you want to be part of this trend. Right, so we've longed off the Bone Storm game. That's not happening anymore. Where the hell am I going? Uh, and we, we're now getting fireworks. Bart is just easily misled. He's a fucking sheep. I bet you can convince Bart to do heroin. Oh uh, yeah, heroin's cool, Bart. Just do a bit of, just take a little bit of heroin. It's fine. Oh, okay. Oh, it's my stoner pothead bus driver, Otto, who I'm gonna kick. One box of your finest quality Chinese frog launchers, please. Here you go, two kilos of Chinese sky candy. They'll blow you away. Am I buying fireworks or am I buying drugs? Because that sounds like a that sounds like a euphemism for drugs. Sorry, Bot. I can't serve booze to a minor. It ain't right. I'm here to buy fireworks. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> Why is Bart involved with so many uh so many grown up men? <laughs> He's associated with like loads of middle-aged men. <laughs> Eat asphalt, asphalt eaters. Who's he saying that to? Is that the uh, guy that Lisa marries in a, a possible alternate future? It looks like him. He looks like the uh, British dude. I'm gonna kick him anyway. Ah, oh, it's Snape. Shit is premium, dude. Premium! Look at me beating up grown men. <laughs> now don't blow your kid, dude. Or do? What do I care? Hello, Ralph. I'm scared. <laughs> I see dead people. Oh god, I just pretty much murdered the, the chief's son. I don't know if this will help or not, but can I... <laughs> yep, I can. <laughs> I know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna try and buy fireworks off of Ralph, and then it's gonna set him off. I'm not even too sure if this is gonna work or not. I'm gonna turn you around a little bit. I'm, I'm really hoping this works. I feel like this will be a waste of uh, five minutes for me. Three minutes that I'll never get back. Oh, I'll probably just waste them anyway. Right, okay, so that takes care of the witnesses. <laughs> I'm in danger. Oh god, he's on his way. My daddy's going what a creepy child. He looks really fucking creepy there. He told me to burn things. Fireworks, eh? You're looking at five lights. <laughs> it worked. It cost me 50 coins uh, due to another offence that I just made, but it worked. <laughs> so later, prick. That boy should be dead by now. Oh, it's the comic book guy. It's me in five years' time. Bitch. Dead. Ever. Hey, job of the fat. Do you know where I can get a copy of Bone Storm 2? God, Bart's an absolute savage. He, you may be fat shaming him, but you got a fucking head like fucking R2-D2. <laughs> If I met a 10 year old like that, I would have no shame in to roundhouse kicking that fucker in the face if I got fat shamed by a 10 year old. Warp speed. I'm trying to go warp speed. Oh god, I've lost this. I'm happy to report that your quest for Bonestorm 2 is quite futile. Who's this woman creeping up on him? He has bought up all the remaining video games. Oh. I'll take you not to moan in my mid sized vehicle. Oh, it's just like buying a PS5 all over again. And I had to go through exactly this. Exactly this. Well, off we go to the stadium. But first, there's one over Hans Mole Man. God, this car takes damage so quickly. And on account of me being a terrible driver as well. But I'm just putting some realism in there, because this is how a 10-year-old would probably drive. Oh, God, I've parked on top of Frink. I don't think he's ever going to get back up. Nope, he's my prisoner now, apparently. I gotta play Bone Storm 2. Give me one! No can do, my pointy-headed friend. I need the power of video game violence to run my latest adventure. See, another adult. <laughs> Why is he talking to so many grown men? Bone Storm 2, communication radio, and... Satellite. Cool. Real violence is way better than TV violence. He is right. Real violence is better than uh, video game violence. I think after this, I'm gonna go in my local town and just kick everyone. Time for some road rage, Bart Simpson style. Yeah, which is uh, fucking manic and terrible, by the way. Hello, Chief Wiggum. God, he looks like he's seen some shit. He looks shocked and appalled. Anyway, I'm gonna kick you. Who's <laughs> he saying that to? Out of my way as I roll down the street. Springfield's lamest. What's the deal? Didn't you hear? Herman's been robbed. Oh no. Now where am I gonna get a radio? These fresh skid marks. 
Now he's being childish. <laughs> yep, that's a great place to stand, just right in the middle of the fucking road. Um, do I know you, little dude? We only met, like, a few minutes ago. You sold me, uh, fireworks. How do you not remember my fucking massive head? Last time I checked, chicks like fast cars, not vintage electronics. Why don't we race for the radio? He just actually just accepted a race from a ten-year-old. <laughs> Yeah, I got this. He's a fucking idiot. <laughs> Out the way, prick. Oh, that was incredibly easy. I'll have your radio. Thank you very much. Oh, Jasper. We haven't kicked him yet. I think, um, I think a change of clothes is in order. So what we've got here, we've got English soccer bar, ISIS bar, or we got gangster bar. I want to go with ninja bar. Ninjas? That's gay. Look at me. I'm kicking white trash. Hey, what's going on on this side? Mr. Slackjaw, yo, 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 That be I. Can I borrow your satellite dish? If you help me scoop up my meat. So that's why it's called Krusty Burger. That's what makes the, the burger so crusty. All the roadkill they use. No! <laughs> Damn it, foiled by a train. We got the roadkill, now we can send it off to Krusty Burger. Oh god, I feel like the, the music makes me feel like I'm in the Dukes of Hazards. Please stop what you are doing. No one can sell rotten meat in this town but me. Why is everyone selling rotten meat? What the fuck's wrong with this town? Have to run over Mole Man. Krusty Burgers are made of roadkill? Why are you asking this now? We've been collecting roadkill. God, this boy's a fucking idiot. Thanks, inbred hillbilly. Wow, savage. He just gave you a fucking satellite dish and you just called him inbred. Right, let's uh, get back to this stadium. Oh, it's my bully, Nelson. Hey, everybody, look at this. It's that boy who laughed at everyone. Let's laugh at him. Oh, there's a child attached to my car. What is happening to him? <laughs> He's like phasing in and out of reality. Now fetch me a blender with the pure air and the frow flower and the wet with flower eyes. It's like a holographic image. Get a blender. Oh, <gasps> Dr. Nick. Hi, Dr. Nick. Or should I say, Dr. Kick. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi. Not now, okay? Man, jeez. Have escaped. What the fuck is this girl looking at? I'm in a cutscene. Fuck off. I better get a big truck or something. Complete this mission, you will need Mr. Plow. What? I bought the Plow King. Just use that. It's bigger. Oh, look at Homer's face. That's my resting, confused face. Fuck you, Dad. That was so painful. Oh, the game won't let me kick him anymore. Oh, no. Got one more in there. I need your truck, Homer. Why should I give you that? Because I love you. <laughs> You've just kicked me a bunch of times, you fucking pest. 200? Well, he's, make a, he's made a sweet profit then, because I paid 150 for the Plow King. Maybe Homer is smart. I'm still going to kick him, though. Right, let's collect these monkeys. Are they just uh, sitting in the back? I can't see any monkeys in this vehicle. I feel like catching one monkey would be uh, a nuisance enough, let alone fucking 30. <laughs> Who owns 30 monkeys anyway? That's crazy. Oh, my God. Am I going to make it? Probably not. Oh, I did, surprisingly. Am I actually grabbing these monkeys, or am I just running them over and then just giving them uh, the dead carcasses to Dr. Nick? Because I could probably sell them, sell the uh, dead monkey meat to Krusty Burger, because I hear they use roadkill. God, these monkeys... He's look fucking petrified as well. Look at him. Oh, must run over Hans Mole Man again. I don't know why I have this fascination of running Hans Mole Man over, but it's just it's just great. It's just one of those pleasantries that get me through the day. Oh, I've got to get out of my car. God damn it. And that's 30. I kind of don't want this mission to end, like on account of this music being just amazing. I feel like I just want to get out on the streets and do some salsa dancing. Welcome home, Daddy's little angels. Now. Oh, I thought he was saying that to me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about the monkeys. I thought Dr. Nick was just being weird. <laughs> what is he doing? He's still, like, glitching to fuck. Unfortunately, there are too many people using cell phones. Yeah, I can tell. It looks like you're malfunctioning. Destroy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, well, um, that took a dark turn. By the way, go kill some people. Oh, God, this thing does not plow at all. Should be called Mr. Shove. Oh, I get it. I get jokes. <laughs> I'm here all night, by the way. There's going to be a very sad family out there asking where their dad is. Oh, he got killed by a, a 10 year old driving Mr. Plow. Whee! And he's oh, dead. <laughs> So just a disclaimer, don't use your mobile phone while driving, because you never know, you might get a fucking 10 year old kid driving Mr. Plow trying to destroy your car. So think. <laughs> this is the worst time to get hit and run. I've got to try and kill someone while getting, while being chased by the police. No! <laughs> I'm trying to kill someone. Arrest him, he's, just, he's the one using his cell phone while driving. I've just done a little bit of collateral damage and murdered three other people, but that's not the point. 
Well done, my little sociopath. Sociopath? Fucking psychopath. I've just murdered a bunch of guys. My truckosaurus will go on a killing rampage with the screaming and the sadness and the hosing of blood off the robot. <laughs> Wow, Truckosaurus is some kind of truck slash dinosaur. I never would guess. I'm sorry, but who's overseeing this? How the fuck did he miss that giant head? Yes, everybody do the man, man. Oh, and off he goes, getting anal probed. All I'm saying is you asked for this, Bart. Kept hanging out with old men, and now you're being abducted by aliens. That's what happens when you're a 10-year-old and you start chatting with middle-aged men. You get abducted. Now, I've come to the realization that playing this game, I may have been playing it a bit violently. I'm going to tone down the violence, and I'm just going to give you a nice, tranquil, and peaceful let's play today with no violence, or kicking, or maiming, or murdering. It's just going to be nice and quiet. Right, let's do some missions. Now that's over and done with. Just like me in life, just watching a vehicle go around the scale electrics over and over again. I mean, he's got to be high, right? Oh, who could we be? Lisa Cool. Lisa Florida. Lisa Hockey. Well, they're all cool, to be honest. I mean, you're not going to be Lisa Florida, so let's go with Lisa Florida. There we go. <laughs> that doesn't scream crazy at all. I'm just a crazy eight-year-old girl. Anyway, let's talk to uh, the comic book guy. First, I need to push him. See, I'm not being violent. I'm just, just gently pushing him out of the frame. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how far can he go? <laughs> he's, he's probably thinking, what the fuck is she doing? Why is Florida pushing me? I need to find my stupid brother. Have you seen him? He, he looks like he's talking talk to a loaf of bread. Let's get the last copy of the new Itchy and Scratchy Adventures comic. It's the <laughs> issue in which they finally kiss. Okay, why why Sorry, is this eight-year-old girl just stepped slow. into this grown man's car that she I barely knows? Oh, crap. We're off to an amazing start. Oh, I think there's a shortcut here, I think. Oh, crap. I need speed. More speed. Shut up, Lisa. What the hell is this thing? Oh, this is inconvenient. Oh, God, we're not going to make it. We don't have deflector shields, you know. Clearly not. Oh, and we're here. And the comic is just laying on the floor, floating. Now, can you tell me if you've seen my pointy-headed nuisance? Oh, I'm on the timer. I completely forgot. Get this comic into a mylar bag. Or it deteriorates into near mint condition. Does he, does he really need me here? I'm just in the passenger seat. He's doing all the driving. Hey, I'm just a little girl. Exactly, I'm just a little girl, and I'm <laughs> I'm in this grown man's car. It's just starting to be weird. Where are the parents? Where's Where's Marge and Homer? Oh, they really are the worst parents in America. Out of the way, official fanboy business. Move, official hentai business. There we go. We did it. What about Bart? I asked you, have you seen him? The arcade. Drive to the arcade? I mean, we could just walk there. It's literally across the road. Okay, well, if you insist on driving there, I'm not going to argue with that. Hello, Millhouse. There's enough Millhouse for everyone! <laughs> oh, there is. Enough Millhouse to kick. Oh, I can't kick him. Oh, God, the game's stopping me from being violent. It's had enough. The people of Springfield have spoken, and they do not wish to be kicked today. Yeah. Here. Uh, I haven't seen him. Hey, can I buy your frozen yogurt? Ooh, actually, well, your frozen yogurt does sound pretty I decent, actually. But it comes with a free frogurt. You have to help me find him. Well, he might be at Wally Weasel's. He likes the smell of the ball cage. He I likes the now. smell of the ball cage. Wow. Time to hit the Not the first time I've heard that one. <laughs> well, what is an eight year old doing with her own car? Oh, well, that was easy. Why is Milhouse there? <laughs> Millhouse, Millhouse everywhere. I'm starting to think he's just, he's not a person, he's an entity. He's everywhere, he's everyone. You're Millhouse, I'm Millhouse. Oh, a ball pit. This is like the only and first time we see Maggie and these other weird shaped babies. It looks like he's from Canada in South Park. Yeah, what are you doing, buddy? Bye, Maggie. Well, well, that's the end of Maggie. She suffocated in plastic balls. All right, where's Millhouse? You're not Millhouse. There you are. Robot House! What are you doing here? <laughs> Is that a new dress? No, I've been wearing this dress for years. <laughs> Have you? It's gonna be her prom outfit as well. Jeez, it went flying. It ascended into, into the gates of heaven there. 
Seriously, what is the point of that? Honestly. Right, let's try and make it this time. We got it, we got it, we got it. Oh, yeah. Obviously, last time I've been way down by the, the giant mass of the comic book guy. Actually, <laughs> he did a whole flip there. Oh, hi, Lisa. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. Stop following me. Perhaps you'd like to share some chewing gum. For speed. And he just disappeared. Right, I've worked out. He's teleporting to these places now. See, he's not a human. Go. Sorry, just an eight-year-old going Sorry. on a massive killing spree. Oh, God, I've got the police on me. I've... <laughs> Why is she laughing? She's gone completely insane. Incoming bad guy. Yes, the police are the bad guys in this situation. You are completely right, Lisa. Oh, shit, I've got 20 seconds left. I'm not going to make this. Oh, God, no, this isn't happening. <laughs> yep, time to move. We've got four seconds. Yeah, this isn't happening. Oh, dear. <laughs> Collect coins to purchase a different vehicle. Your vehicle that you're using is shit. Try a different one. Oh, is there a short? There's a shortcut around here, I think. No, there isn't. Oh my god, I failed this mission again. Oh god, thank god. Why at least? Oh god, I've lost Smill House. Please don't sue. Well, you can't sue now. He's dead. Hi, Lisa. Hi. Your hair looks pointy today. <laughs> Does it? My hair looks like a loaf of bread. Lisa, do you have a date for the harvest dance? This is not a good time. It's never a good time! <laughs> Bart always hung out at the quickie mart. This mission was pointless. Excuse me, Fred, coming through. Hello, Apu. It's just like the episode when Lisa's trying to find out who she is. She gets that letter. She reads it. You are a murderer. <laughs> a cold-hearted killer. Oh, this is terrible. A very bad man is delivering dogs to all the Krusty Burgers, which are cheaper than my Krusty Burgers. Okay, and now I've ended up in his car. Great. Oh, I just wanted to know is where's Bart? Oh, this is the same roadkill from the last level. This is like the most insane subplot in this game. The rivalry between Fleeters and Apu. Jesus Christ, that poo's car goes. Oh, come on, come on. Wait, where did he go? <laughs> that was pretty cool. Jesus Christ, Lisa has a taste of blood. Perhaps you should consult Professor Brink at the observatory. Here we are at the destination. Thank you, come again. And he's just disappeared. He could have just told me that really quickly before I had to get into his car. Right, let's go talk to my favorite weird scientist. Frink? No, Frink. Frink? No, Frink. Frink? No, Frink. Frink? No, Frink. Right, okay, I'll shut up now. Professor Frink! Professor Frank! Why are you shouting? Bart is, his brother Bart is missing. Have you seen him? Well, let's see now. Um, Bart helped me build a monster and then disappeared in a bright light. Wow, this is crazy. I need someone to talk to who's wise and learned. Maybe Apu has seen him. <laughs> oh, Grandpa, we actually haven't kicked him yet. <laughs> <laughs> Get down the stage, you old bastard. Maybe I'm just a senile old man, but Bart's lucky red hat fell out of that black car. Maybe I'm just a senile old man, but you're dressed as a sandwich. I think my baby teeth are growing the back. I better use something big if I want to take that car out. The Plow King. Like that school bus. No, we got the Plow King and Mr. Plow. Oh my god. What's this need of buying massive vehicles? We already have one. Plow King can do it. I need speed. More speed. See, now she wants drugs. All right, let's film Top Gun. All about drugs. Tom Cruise, search for speed. Oh, what's in here? Oh, I did not want to be... Can I go back up? Oh, well, this is pointless. Oh, I've got to go all the way back up now. Oh, it's, uh, what's his name? Uh, one of the people that works for Fat Tony. I don't even need to kick him. He's just done enough work there. What is he doing? How did he get himself down there? All right, how many coins do I have? Three, nine, five. That might get us a school bus. I think given my past experiences, I think uh, a school bus normally costs around 350 Buzz Cola coins from what I've experienced personally in real life. Oh, shit. <laughs> right, let's talk to this pothead. Otto, I know I'm a little young to be asking this. Look, I don't have any special brownies left. I ate them all. But do you think I can use your school bus? Oh, <laughs> right. Cool. Oh, 300. I wasn't too far off. Blow up cars to find a clue. I don't think that's how detective work works, you know? Oh, I found a hat. The hat that Bart wasn't wearing because he was in a ninja costume. 
I mean, I definitely could have done this with the Pal King. I mean, if anything, probably would have been easier with the Pal King. Bang, bang, chi chi bang, bang, chi chi bang, bang, we love you. And Pal, chi chi bang, bang, chi chi bang, bang, love you too. Again, the Simpsons just love ramming into cars and killing random people. How'd you like a newspaper? How would I like a newspaper upside my head? I'm more curious to find out what that entails. I've got to go. Ow, my hair. Got to go. Who is she talking to? She's absolutely crazy. Ow, my hair. Oh, God, too much destruction. I just can't think. I don't think I can cope. How many black sedans do I have to destroy until I find my brother? Oh, I can intercept him. Yes. Right, just a little gentle tap. <laughs> well, okay, he basically killed himself there. I have no part in that. This reminds me of when I was a little girl. What, the casino? Dressed as Florida? Next to the police? <laughs> what the fuck is she doing in front of Chief Wiggum? Ah, uh, sorry, little girl. I'm busy collecting evidence on Jailbird. We're busting him on the three strikes law. How many strikes do you have so far? Uh, no strikes. First of all, if we're gonna go undercover, you will need a disguise. I mean, this is a pretty decent disguise I'm wearing. I've got a disguise. Oh god, this level is absolutely milking me dry in terms of finances. Oh, the squeaky team. We haven't kicked him yet. Oh, two in one. This guy, who I can't remember the name of as well. Lisa Normal. Is that Lisa Normal? She doesn't look normal there. Right, so the, so the cool disguise costs about 250 coins. But hang on a minute. Put in another 50 coins there. 300, you get yourself a school bus. And here's the thing, right? Why are Bart and Lisa blonde? Shouldn't they have like brown hair or blue hair? I mean, who are Bart and Lisa's real parents? Can't think of any blonde people from The Simpsons right now, so I'm just gonna add them to the screen now of possible fathers of Bart and Lisa. Oh, it's The Simpsons' favorite family friend, Principal Skinner. Look at his legs just coming out of the car. Strike one, counterfeit designer jeans. Why did he just throw his jeans out of the, out the car? I mean, shouldn't we be arresting him on account of, like, public exposure or indecency? Whatever the fuck it's called. Donald ducking. Oh, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Oh, shit. we got to go back to the casino in 50 seconds. Jesus Christ. This game is not friendly on time. I mean, I'm assuming the game expects you to be quite good at this point, but not me. <laughs> now, about your brother. I've seen lots of mysterious government types over at the docks. You are a good cop after all. Ah, you're just saying that. Yes, I am. <laughs> Zing! And now I'm gonna kick the fuck out of you. I fought the law and the Lisa won. I think, um, if my memory serves me correctly, which normally it doesn't, I think the secret car is on Zad's boat up there. How was an eight-year-old jumping that high, honestly? There we go. There it is. Again, I don't remember the, ever seeing this boat car in the in the show. Or maybe I did and I just can't remember. I've seen a lot of Simpsons. There are, There is a lot of Simpsons. All right, let's talk to the seaman, Captain. Chief Wiggum said there was some strange stuff going on around here. Have you noticed anything weird? You know, black sedans, guys with dark glasses. Uh, yeah, some eight-year-old kid was driving around here earlier, running over loads of people, killing thousands along her way. Yeah, maybe I've seen something. And he's not seen fuck all. I he's got two glass eyes, hasn't he? Wouldn't you be a favor, and it might jar the memory. Oh, God, I don't like where this what is going. Favorite? Can you navigate the fishies to the finest restaurants in the squish 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 squid port? I'm going to have to do so much babysitting to pay for that. I think you're going to have to do a lot of community service for the uh, criminal offences you've been doing today, Lisa. For an eight-year-old as well, that's just absolutely fucked. I want to say we're doing an all right job at the moment, but I don't want to jinx it. Oh, God, if I wasn't going to get that, then oh, I don't know what I would have done. All it took was a little tap of the sea captain to get the police on me. I saw your brother. Really? That's great. Aye, he was in a long black limo, and ahoy, there she drove. Wait, am I destroying it or following it? I can't remember. Right, I'm gonna get the, I'm gonna get Mr. Plow. Oh, what's the acceleration like? Uh, it's bit... <laughs> Sixty-nine percent damaged. Okay, I think I'm gonna destroy my vehicle before that. I mean, he's clearly not in that car, right? There is clearly just one person in there. Oh, great, now I'm gonna get the cops on me again. God damn it. I'm just trying to murder a limo here. Oh, for Christ's sake. Damn, I blew up Bart. He was in the limo. <laughs> he can't, he died in that black limo you just destroyed. Yes, you did. He got out and he boarded that ship. Can you take me there? Nah, I hate the sea. 
How does he know? He was just standing there the whole time. Oh shit, we have to go. Like pronto. I'll be very, very lucky if I manage to land on this boat with this car. But we'll, we'll try it anyway. Kid power! Sorry. Oh god, I actually ran him over. <laughs> I think I actually did kill Bart. Oh no, he's fine. Him and his meathead is fine. Right, let's kick him while we still have the chance. I wash my suit with a rag on a stick. Bart, I found you. What's your favorite catchphrase? Kiss my grits. That is his favorite catchphrase. That's my favorite catchphrase. Kiss my grits. Kiss my grits. Okay. All I can do is take you home. Get you a diaper. I cannot remember anything from this level. Marge looks absolutely terrifying for some weird reason. I feel like she's just staring into my soul. Oh god, that's even more terrifying. The Blair Witch Marge. Right, okay, let's talk to my wacko jacko son, Bart Simpson. Well, he sounds like what I sound like at a music festival. What's causing your ooga booga ga booga ga booga ga booga talk? My special little guy's noogle has turned to Google. She's talking in rhymes. The whole town's gone nuts. The whole town's gone nuts. So cover your butts. Goddamn son. Get out of my house, you freak. And he's not even phased by it. He's got balls of steel. Oh, okay, we're jumping straight into it. Well, wow, that was not waiting at all. Oh, there's Bumblebee Man. We need to kick him later. Right, we need to find Hans Mole Man. That is the top number one priority in this Let's Play today. Find Hans Mole Man and run him over a bunch. Oh, this guy's not phased that I'm just on top of his police car. God, that is... That has got to hurt her knees. Oh, I'm actually, it's, I'm actually inside the car now. <laughs> she is not human. She is a ghost. The ghost of Christmas Marge. Right, anyway, let's talk to Chief Wiggum. Out of my way, dirtbag. <laughs> oh god, he is continuously tumbling and tumbling and tumbling. Oh, okay, I think I've actually broken Chief Wiggum. There he goes, just rolling into the distance. He's a national hero. <laughs> Look at him go. He's constantly- Get up for fuck's sake. I need to carry on with the game. We're not going to get past mission one. Jesus, finally. Right, okay. I'll be. Able... What the fuck is this one here? Why does she run like a zombie? <laughs> Why? I feel like she should be an Ed, Ed, and Eddie with the, you know, how weird they all run. <laughs> she should be the fourth member. Ed, Ed, and Eddie, and Marge. Chief Bart, I need you to find out what happened to Bart. We've already asked Chief Wiggum about this shit. He doesn't know anything. Ah, that's cute. But I got sugar withdrawal real bad. Real bad. The donut store is closed, and I got a monkey on my back screaming for crawler. Okay, so I'm getting permission to do this by the police, right? Okay, okay, let's uh, nudge the donut truck until donuts fly out. Because that's how it works. That's that's how lo the laws of physics work. I mean, th there's got to be another way of getting donuts. I mean, surely this isn't the only way. I mean, there's a quickie mart just around the corner from here. Or is there just suddenly a, a shortage of donuts in, in Springfield? Why is this donut truck really fucking fast? <laughs> Come on, one more, one more, one more. There we go. Sure hope no one saw that. Oh, there were, there were many witnesses. Oh, God, I am a crazy driver. Oh, Kenny, I killed a child. To be fair, I've killed many children in this game. Oh, well, Jesus Christ, what is going on here? Can you narrow? No, I can't. Boy, for a busybody housewife, you sure get results. I'm getting a lot of coffee. <laughs> Love a little chant. <laughs> so, that did not solve anything. Now what? Tell me where my son is, bitch. Oh, well, there's Bumblebee, man. We haven't kicked him yet, so... <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> wow, and that was the end of Marge. One more. <laughs> god, that's what I sound like when I drive anywhere. Just constantly screaming. Hello, I'm Marge. My army man tastes like plastic! Yeah? How does my foot taste like? Excuse me? I don't care if you is from New York. No, Cletus, it's me, Marge. Marge! Wait, so I'm stealing from Cletus now? What is going on here? I'm com I'm so confused. I, I don't know if I'm help. Am I helping him or am I just stealing from him? Everyone's out to fuck Cletus. Apu is. Bart is. Now... Marge! Oh, Jesus Christ. This car is still like it's made of polystyrene or something. Oh, God. It's so hard to... to Keep on four wheels. Nice girls finish fast. And mean girls finish lean. Is that a thing? I don't know. I think I just made that one up. Oh my god, if I lose him now, I'm gonna be so pissed off. I feel like I've been doing this mission for roughly about an hour and a half now. <laughs> it feels like anyway. 
No, I can't, Marge. I cannot Canyonero. Well, that was a that was a waste of time. I have to find out what happened to my baby boy. I ain't telling you shit. Listen, you help us with the harvest. I better change, or my next mission will be to get baby things out of green rayon. Inmate clothes? I've got to dress like an inmate. This game's just making up excuses for you to buy different clothes. Oh, you're out there somewhere, mole man. And I will find you. No, you won't. Yes, I will. Okay, so what's this? I have to climb I have to climb through the window to get into my own son's room. <laughs> we could just could have just gone through the front door. She it's something just so unearthly about her face. It just really freaks me out. <laughs> and now I just look like a zombie inmate. Get out of my way! <laughs> <laughs> She's gone absolutely nuts. People done throwed out to feed on during the long winter. Help me fetch you. Oh, I can just buy you a bottle of ketchup. There's a quickie mark just around the hey, corner. We can just uh, buy ketchup here, there. Shot. Okay, I don't think I'm going to do this. I've got 30 seconds left. Oh, crap. Yeah, this isn't going to get done. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm absolutely getting my arse ripped out on this game. Oh, no. <laughs> And why do I have to do it before the time runs out? I mean, they're still going to be there after two minutes. Did Tom Jones do the uh, music to this part? Oh, shit, I've gone a completely different way. I got distracted again. Oh, I've missed one as well. Oh, you know what? I'm going to restart this mission again because I've absolutely fucked myself over. I don't know what I was doing there, but it wasn't good. During the long week oh, God damn it. Already screwed up. This is not my day. Okay, so we're just... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is up with the cars in this level? Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. There's no way I'm doing this fucking level again. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God, 40 seconds to have to clean his house. Jesus Christ, this mission is just full on. Oh, for fuck's sake. God, look at me drift. Okay, come on, I've got to do this jump. Oh, no. Oh, thank God. Oh, God, that, that mission was just absolutely just so just full on. Constant adrenaline rush. You might and should ask some other old folks about it. Maybe try around the graveyard. And he could have told me that before I got into his car. God damn it. And now I'm stranded. Oh, yeah, I think the secret vehicle is in here. I think it's a quad bike. There it is. There we go. It's the quad bike that absolutely runs like shit. God, this is hard to control. <gasps> oh, my God. Hans... Freaking mole man. Road rage. Mole man. <laughs> it was worth it. Right, let's kick the fuck out of him. This is in my heart. <laughs> the police can't even get me from there. Oh, they still busted me. What? I had a fence between us. Oh well. Can you help me? Shh. I'm hiding from the police. If the police find me out past curfew, they'll throw me in jail. I won't survive another night in jail. <laughs> Poor Hans Mo man. I've seen a crop circle. Talk to a. Oh, again with the Chief Wiggum? Oh, shit. Well, this isn't going to happen, is it? My car's about to blow up, and I, it's, it's, the, it's the shittiest vehicle. Look, I can't even turn. Well, I'm going to have to get another car and then restart this mission. I'll get Bart's car. Why not? There we go. Marge riding Bart's car. There's something you don't see every day. What wackiness this is. Right, we can still beat Chief Wiggum, I think. Well, fuck. No, we can't. Okay, this may have been just a bad idea. Yep. I mean, to be fair, I did give you like a 15-minute head start, Chief Wiggum. So, there you go. I'll do my best. Oh, why could I have just start in my car? Why is it so hard to program Marge to just start in the car? Ha, <laughs> bitch. Right, we're going to beat him this time around. What the fuck? Wait, why did I follow him? Why am I an idiot? <laughs> God. Oh, great. Now I've actually got the police chasing me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, he's called for backup. <laughs> Why can't I finish this simple race to the fucking retirement home? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Right, okay. Fourth time's a charm. Let's fuck him up. This is like the shortest race ever. <laughs> this needs to be a mission. Mom, I'm sorry. <laughs> Poor grandpa. I can't tell you about crop circles right now. Let me guess, I have to race Chief Wiggum or something. Crop circles and begging aggrieve of Oh dear. How could 
said you hooligans steal an old man's medication. You give it back right now. Oh, we traded it to some dudes in a black car for these play dudes. Check it out, man. This one's got an interview with the guy who invented the wah 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 pedal. I'm still gonna kick him anyway for being such a dick. Oh, another hit and run. God damn it. Send the bill to Homer. I mean, Homer's the only breadwinner of the house, so. I mean, you can't pay for it, Marge. Oh, this is gonna be like 10 times harder. Just get it over and done with. Let me go. Thank you. I'm probably gonna fail this mission as well. How is he dropping these? It's, he must be just be throwing him out the window. Wait, where did he go? Oh, for fuck's sake, really? Oh my god, I'm never gonna get this done. Imagine being in a school playground and just seeing a fucking tiny rocket with some crazy inmate blue haired person just flying over. They look like tubs of Hagen dazs or something. Look at them, they're massive. How many pills does he need? Come on, one more to go, and then I'm scot free. There we go. Does it matter how, how long it takes me to get back to retirement home? Specifically, in one and a half minutes? Why? Why does it need to be one and a half minutes? Oh, god damn it. Now I've got to get away from the back of Dan. Got these levels. Uh, oh, for fuck's sake, these missions are literally testing my patience. Sweet, sweet, no medication. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Great. Now I need something to wake him up. His eyes are clearly open. Look at him. <laughs> He's awake. Maybe these will jog your memory. <laughs> ah, what? <sighs> for the last f***ing time, tell me about the crap circles. What about a toad and his Nazi henchmen? What in one of them? A raccoon, as I recall. It's me with a banjo. No, I never reason with a raccoon, let alone a Nazi one. This time I rode in a water car. Okay, okay. It was so long ago that I'll have to describe it in sepia tone. The important thing was that I had an onion on my belt, which was a style at the time. A planet with an antenna? Hmm, that sounds awfully familiar. I think it was at the Quickie Mart. That's it. It was on a bottle of pop. Maybe that will jog Bart's memory. Who the hell is driving that vehicle? Because it's not human. That looks like an alien. I bring you love. Right, let's go to Bart's room. And the only way to get to Bart's room is climb through the fucking window, I guess. Because we can't use the front door and go through his room, you know, the normal way. We have to climb through the side of the house. Why can't I do that? I can't even do that. Absolutely failing in this level. Bart, do you recognize this design? Look at his great staring eyes. Control cola. They gave us tons of that up in the alien spaceship. They're using it to make the town go crazy. Oh, Marge's boobs are really pointy. I'm going to the arcade. This conspiracy goes all the way to the top. I need a little extra firepower. As Officer Marge. Oh my god, Officer Marge, why do you have to change so frequently? Did I just get changed in front of my own son? That was weird. Now where do I go? <laughs> exactly. Who turned off the lights? Why is the timer started now? Wait for me to get into a car. Oh, because we have to complete this on foot. Probably still a shit ton of cans out there in Springfield. I don't know what that did. Didn't really make much difference at all, if you ask me. Where is this stuff coming from? Well, there is little here not tainted in some way. Even the astrology scrolls give poor advice. But I will get to the bottom of this. There he is. Hans Moleman. What exactly is he thinking? What am I even talking about? I'm just monologuing. For no apparent reason. And any other evil cola trucks I can find. Finally! Utilising the Plow King and not having to buy another fucking large car. You're mine, bitch! Oh god, no, it's pushing me now! The Plow King's being plowed! Oh great, now I'm gonna get the fuzz of me a yet again for the fifth time. Starting to think the Plow King was a terrible choice. I keep hitting every other car apart from the one I need to... Oh, for fuck's sake, really? Oh. Does that count as destroying it? Oh no! Oh god, I have broken the game. Oh no, I can't- I haven't even saved it! Oh, I'm gonna have to come back to this in another recording session. Please bear with me. Well, that was a weird doozy. No idea what happened there, but the game broke and I forgot to save. So I had to do all of that again. And what a, what a place for the game to cut out right on the last mission as I destroyed the third truck. Marge is coming at you like the Terminator and you're Sarah goddamn Connor. Can you narrow? Oh, that was pathetic. Oh, that not so much. Why is this happening? I ask myself that all the time. 
Oh, well, it's not even blown up. There it is in its entirety. Right, let's try and make this jump for the first time. Oh my god, I went high. That was like an ET moment there. Out of the way, everyone. Official Marge business. Oh god. Hit and run. Son of a biscuit. Son of a biscuit indeed. Oh, sh shite. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I should pay more attention. Oh, Marge, shut up. You're distracting me. Get away from Chief Wiggum. Why are we getting away from Chief Wiggum? You took my precious cola, Marge. It's the only thing that gives me the courage to take off my shirt in the station locker room. Oh, well, he got far, didn't he? Oh, well, that's it. Well, I've done all the missions. That's grand. That was a worth it payoff. That was an anticlimactic showdown between me and Chief Wiggum. I feel betrayed. Yes, I want to save my game. I do not want to go through all that again. For no reason, here's a boo. Jesus Christ, his car really does go. I feel like there's going to be some quick races in this part. Again, with, same with the Marge level. I can't remember any of the emissions that come with this level. So, at the moment, this is all new to me. Oh, wait, there's the secret car. Oh, we'll make that. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I must finish quickly or vomit. That's what she said. I'm pretty sure in the in the TV show that Apu's car is red and not yellow. Well, I'm at the point. Now what? Do I need to get out first? You know what? Actually, I have an idea. I need a big truck. Oh, an ambulance. That would do. See, my idea is... See if I can block him. There's no one even driving this car. Oh my god, look at the ambulance guy. It's another alien. I bring you peace. Oh, I have been selling tainted cola. Unless I redeem myself, I will be reincarnated as Tainted Cola, or worse, Tainted Cola. I must find the source of the Oh, where's the, um, where's the ambulance? God damn it. Right, okay. oh shit. Well, that was a great start. I feel like this is going to be a struggle. <laughs> now I remember why I don't remember this level, because it's just so hard. I think I did struggle a lot with the first le uh, first mission when I first played this. Now I get to relive my childhood rage. Oh shit, that was too quick. Jesus, we're just leaving a path of destruction behind us. I'm pretty sure we're doing more harm than good right now at this point. I feel like this truck is going to just blow itself up beforehand. What are you trying to do? Jesus. Wasn't too sure whether to go up the ramp or not. Well, to be fair, no one's even driving it, it seems, so it makes sense. Oh, God. Staying in silence because I'm concentrating so hard. This may be just a quiet let's play today because I'll be concentrating so hard into completing these missions. <laughs> Oh god, my, my hands are so sweaty <laughs> already. Legitimate businessman social club. Wee! <laughs> what a nice little air kick he did there. Oh, it's this guy I forgot the name of again. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> Why do all these drivers look so weird? Look at him. It looks like he's got a beak. What the fuck is that? Hello, stereotypical Italians. We don't know nothing. Except that the brains are controlled by mysterious strangers. And your family. Oh my gosh, reminded me of my fatherly duties. I'm supposed to pick up the octuplets at the doctors. Oh god, my car's all the way down there and I got like 50 seconds. Not even that. 40. The mob's the limo? Why is the mob chasing me now? Jesus Christ, that was incredibly, surprisingly easy. Me and you. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Right, okay, we need to find Hans Mongman as well. Why am I just constantly running away from the mob? Jesus Christ, Apu. Apu's got enemies now. Cletus is his enemy. And now the mob. Come on, come on, come on. How is he catching up so quick? This mission. Oh, great, now I'm going to get the fuzz on me again. Come on, come on. I am trying my hardest here. Oh, great. I'm running away from the mob and the police now. It's cops and robbers in Apu. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, cheers, game. Avoid hitting traffic vehicles. I did not think of that. Thank you for your hints. Hey. All right, finally. I defeated the mob. Apu versus Marlon Brando. That's something we need to see. Oh, my God. It's Dr. Hibbert. I don't think we've kicked him yet. Well, there's always a first time for everything. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Hans Moleman is in this level somewhere. And I will find him. I'm like Liam Neeson at the moment. I will find you, Hans, and I will kill you. <laughs> no, that's too big. I'm afraid we have a medical emergency. What are you doing standing outside doing nothing? <gasps> oh no, my ba babies. Your baby's appendix is about to burst. All over my waiting room. Luckily, I have my trusty pocket knife. And diapers aren't covered by your insurance. Ooh, you better hurry. I heard the parents of the Shelbyville Nine are grabbing every diaper in town. They're grabbing every diaper in town. That's insane. Do you know how many diapers that would be? Maybe Mr. Homer will have a large gas-guzzling American yeah. guzzling vehicle that I could use. Why do I need Homer's custom-built car? Do you have an oversized vehicle that I might be borrowing? Borrowing? Yes. 
Selling to you at an insanely high price? No. I mean, we could use the Plow King. I'm surprised they didn't do the price as $82,000 because that's how much it should be. That monstrosity costs $82,000. There must be a real life version of this car, surely. Oh God, look at all those babies in the back. And I'm just ramming into this car like a madman. Apu has no regard of child safety at all. Oh my God. Stop swerving. Oh God, 18 seconds left. This isn't going to be done. Oh, I smashed my skull. Oh, we was one away. We were so close yet so far. I blame the car for fucking swerving everywhere. Right, I've, I'm disorientated. Where am I? Oh my god. Crashing into everything now. I'm panicking. I would like to destroy that car, but that would be inhumane. Your misfortune is most entertaining to me. How is he just walking that off? Quickly, cover my incontinent children's tushies. <laughs> that was close. Another minute in my office would look like the Ganges River. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. That's a horrible oh, thought. Talk to Krusty. Oh, we haven't kicked Krusty yet. We are kicking so many new people today. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> it was worth it. Famous American clown. I wish to ask a favor. Everyone wants to wet their beaks. You need a professional scumbag. Follow a cop until you find one. You'll have better luck if you, you know, look... American? Well, that's racist. Oh, God. Why is it zoomed into this guy? <laughs> oh, so there's Hans Mole Man, but he's unreachable to kick. Oh, so close yet so far. This will have to do. See a bright light. Is that heaven? <laughs> no, it's hell. That's where you're going, Hans Mole Man. Hell. That's not like a policeman to just drop donuts. Of course, it's like Hansel and fucking Gretel. No, 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 no. Oh, the police station. How convenient. God. Oh, what a smart cookie. Shit. Oh, bollocks. No, he's there. He's there. I could see him. <laughs> he wasn't that far away anyway. Oh, please, someone don't have to do the fucking donut thing again. This is gonna be a rough one. How did I ever complete this as a kid? I would have thought as a gamer, like, I, I have grown since the age of eight, but apparently not. Right, okay. Let's <laughs> stick to Wiggum. Perhaps I should refrain from doing that in the future. Yes, thanks, Apu. I'll try that. Oh my god, am I following... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, <laughs> not the donut thing again. I want to do the donut thing again. Slow and steady wins the race. There's a load of bullshit. He's doing nothing but slow and steady. And he's winning the race. Oh, thank God for that. Jesus Christ. Where did he go? Hand over your wallet, dude. Wait, I, I approached you. That's not how it works. And he's got backup as well. Why is this guy joining in with the conversation? He's waiting in line to mug me. But it will cost you. You have to pick up the litter from my community service. It is a deal. Deal. That's for taking my wallet. And I bet this is going to go like 100 miles per hour as well. This simple garbage truck. Mm, five bits of garbage, yet there's three and a half minutes on the clock. I feel like this is going to go on for quite a while. Although we've got two left. Why is there three minutes on the clock? I can't remember. Oh, right. Okay. I remember now. Jesus. Okay. Right, so it's just a bit of simple, underlining the word simple, driving. Is it just me that finds this level really hard? Or is, it, is anyone else, like, on my level here? Does anyone else agree with me <laughs> that this level is goddamn hard? We've got seven more to do in a span of a minute. I think we can do this. I hope so, anyway, because there's no way I'm going to do this again. Oh, God, if I don't get to the DMV, this would just suck. Oh, that does not give that does not give you enough time to get to DMV, and I have to do that all over again. God damn it! Really, Jesus! Right now, yeah, I can understand why this is like four minutes long. I'll put this mission on par with the, uh, the mission in GTA with zero, when you have to fly the goddamn remote control airplane. In fact, this is probably harder. God, I really don't remember it being this far away. Shit! Wrong way! Wrong way! Wrong way! Fuck! Oh my god! Oh, can we just take a second here? I don't remember this game being so hard. Well, I'm just I'm that much of a sucky player. My friend has the information at the DMV. Go pick it up. Oh, God, the mission's still not over. Jesus Christ. I'll take that. Thank you. Oh, I've got to talk to Snake again. Oh, it's a very snake-heavy episode. Sir, this folder is empty. To rob me is one thing, but I never expected you to lie. Dude, relax, okay? I just need help with a little more community service. We might not even do the first bit of this mission. Get to the destination. Shit, 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 shit. Oh god, this is not a crashing car. At least there's no time limit, I guess. 
Yep, just stay there. That would be great. Oh god, now it's crashing me. <laughs> Could not have picked a more shittier car for me to destroy an armoured fucking vehicle. Oh shit. Uh, how the tables have turned. Dude, you better not have scratched my car. I think he done more than scratch it. <laughs> Need another spanner. Spanner, 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 spanner. Oh god, one more tap. Oh, I didn't really didn't do anything. Oh, okay, we're probably gonna have to run away from Chief Wiggum again. Yep. <laughs> As I predicted. See, I'm getting quite good at this. God, if I hadn't have lost him, I there was no way I would want to do this again. That would have been it. That would have been it for the Simpsons hit and run. Look, the cola trucks are registered to the museum. The museum? Oh, each level of this adventure is more exciting than the last. Is it? Is it though? All right, fuck you, snake. Never again. Oh, hello, Bart. Bart just appeared out of nowhere. Let's kick Bart. Look at me beating up a ten-year-old. What are you looking at? Oh, Mr. Cola, I have discovered that the evil Cola is being made in the Springfield Cola Museum. Kiss my grits. But that closes in five minutes. Oh, it says five minutes, but it's probably going to be five seconds. It said five minutes. That's 30 seconds. That is not five minutes. Where the hell did Bart get this car from? That's a massive upgrade from the honor roller. Oh, wait, no. This is Bart's car he got from Mr. Burns, isn't it? I will destroy it if I can fucking get to it. Right, just got one more little gentle tap to do. Hopefully he will uh, screw himself over. Well, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, what's the key? There it is. Right, drive to the museum in a span of 40 seconds. Of course, why would, why would it make it easy for me? Oh, and it's hit and run. Jesus Christ, it's all happening now. Uh. Right, it's only around the corner, it's only around the corner, it's only around the corner. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, that was a absolute adrenaline rush. Oh God, I've never stressed so much at a game before. I never thought I'd say this, but I'm actually excited to be going to a museum. Shiva H. Kola, the Vishnu is dripping from that meteor. Ooh, I'll feed deadly Kola. We destroyed a priceless archaeological artifact. Ooh. I know it's a cliche, but I caramba! I'm going to introduce the evil cola into the water supply. People will go mad. I like it. Then we distribute laser guns at the Squidport tourist area. I like it. The cola maddened humans will go berserk. I like it. Destroying themselves and their town. I like it. Got to prevent cola putting laser guns in the hands of cola drunk cola 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 townspeople. <laughs> Why? That sounds hilarious. I'd watch that show. I tell you what, you're a bad little cola. Thursday, October 31st. The city streets are crowded for the holiday, even with the rain. Hidden in the chaos is the element, waiting to strike like snakes. And I'm there too, watching. I must choose my targets carefully. Need money. Oh, don't shoot. Just take the money and get out. It's a big city. I can't be everywhere. But they don't know where I am. We have a signal now for when I'm needed. But when the light hits that sky, it's not just a call, it's a warning to them. Fear is a tool. I think I'm hiding in the shadows. But I am the shadows. I'm Krusty the Clown and I'm going to kill you. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! Kiss my grits. What the hell was that? You can tell they've changed this map up a bit. Like the comic book guy was standing here on level 3. Now he's standing there. Oh my god! Ah, Poo Poo, you've got to help me warn Krusty about this alien plot and thus save the good people of Springfield. Up, down, up, down. Uh, go, hot dog. Butter my undershirt. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, hot dog. That's how I speak. Wait, so. We travelled all this way from downtown to here just for a poo to pussy out. More like a pussy, no half a pima petalon. Am I right? Oh yeah, I forgot. Bart only has friends who are of adult age. I gotta round up these other little dudes and get them to Krusty Lou for the studio tour. 
That's where I'm Stop hassling me, midget Abraham Lincoln. Right, let's run these kids over. I mean, uh, politely drop them off uh, to their destination, is what I meant to say. Right, here we go. I remember doing this level a while ago when I was just a mere boy, and I remember this being really fucking hard. God, this is like the, the Simpsons road rage. Oh, shit. No, I'm, I'm wedged. I'm like that vessel that got caught. The Stu's Canal vessel. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, there's like... How do I get out of it? Oh, Jesus Christ. I've blown up the goddamn vehicle. I think... I broke something. Yeah, uh, we kind of blew up there, but Hint, return to your vehicle within 10 seconds. Well, I can't because it fucking blew up. Right, let's try not to screw it up this time. God, that was like a new record. That was like 20 seconds into the first mission. Oh, God, I'm not going to make it, am I? Why is he standing there? Oh, well, I made it. That's surprising. Okay, I think I've got this. Got four more kids to run over, and we've got 40 seconds. I could run over 10 kids in that time. There we go. Well, that went smoothly. A lot smoother than the first attempt. Oh, yeah. Barney, where's Krusty? I have to warn him. Krusty's not here, little Homer. He's Why is she approaching me? Is she getting in the queue to talk to Barney? Why is Barney so popular? Control human behavior. No beverage could do that. Oh no, I haven't had a duff in two hours. My life is over. <laughs> Oh god, don't I know that feeling. So why are we warning Krusty about this? Like, what's the point in this? I think Bart's just making up an excuse to just meet his uh, celebrity crush. And where was this car in the second level? Could have gotten away from uh, Principal Skinner a lot quicker in that first mission with this car than the fucking tiny rocket car. You know what, I'm going to park here because I know if I talk to him, he's probably going to F off. So if I do this, then he might not get away. So... Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, we're racing now. Okay. Why does this fucking clown car go so quick? It's not normally this quick, is it? It's a fucking clown car. And I'm in like a goddamn what appears to be a Ferrari for a child. Oh, son of a beast skit. <laughs> oh, shit. I think I overshot that. Oh, maybe I didn't. Krusty, listen carefully. Aliens are handing out free laser guns and cola that makes you go crazy. It'll be a massacre. The streets will be littered with lasered off limbs and heads. Yeah, right. And I'm getting into the Cunch Hall of Fame. Like, this Bumble this goose chase was all for fun? nothing. It was pointless. That's it. A nerd! Krusty. Where's Krusty? Cunch. Ah, oh, shit. Where's my car? Ah, oh, bollocks. Right, I think we've already lost this. No? Okay. Maybe not. Oh, I like this lounge music. This lounge music's very, uh, very nice. I don't think he actually knows where he's going. Oh, my God. Why is he going around? Oh, for fuck's sake, we're going back down there again. God damn it. Oh, I think I've lost him. Shit. Hopefully he's crashed. Oh, I don't think I've got this. Shit. Yeah, I, I panicked there. <laughs> Why, what, just spawn me in the car. Why is that so hard? Why can't game make mission start in car? And I think somehow we end up in the observatory, which is literally just a five second drive from down here. Right, he's going to go down there. Probably going to come back up again. No doubt. Like, you can't even say he's going for a gentle drive because this is absolutely fucking insane. Like, the smartest person in... Well, one of the smartest people in Springfield... I can't even get from the pier to the fucking observatory. Oh, shit, shit. What the hell happened there? There we go. Finally, eventually got here. Fuck it. I can't even kick him. I want to kick the shit out of him right now, but he won't let me. Professor Frank, you've got to help me. No one believes my story. It's just like the boy who cried wolf, except instead of a wolf, it's a wolf. Aliens? Well, that would explain these strange transmissions from my plutonium CB radio. So, what happened to the weird robot dinosaur that you built? Is that still on the loose, or...? Have we just forgotten about that entirely now? Should probably get a better car than Bart's fucking light-ass car if I'm smashing into stuff. Let's do a mission with Marge. Oh, we're already going the wrong way. Brilliant. Why don't I pick the Canyonero? Oh, well, I had a good run. Yeah, you did, Marge. You had a good run, Marge, but you're just not good enough. Okay, well, we're stuck with the Canyonero now, so I guess we'll just roll with it. Oh, God, why are there so many bends on this road? Oh, God, I'm not going to make it, am I? You know what? Yeah, let's uh, get a new car. <laughs> This isn't happening. Oh, you know what? We'll just <laughs> revert back to the Ferrari. This was a waste of time. <laughs> yeah, this was def I definitely should have just left it as it as it as is. We'll just have to try not to destroy this car. I swear to God, they purposely make the slow cars super fast. <laughs> like normally, if I was driving the Duff truck, it'd go like half a mile per hour. Because we're doing a mission, it's going like 88. Why is it so hard just to tap a simple Duff truck? I've got two more and I've got 50 seconds left. And I don't think I'm going to do it. This could be a level where I actually fail at every single mission that I do today. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Basically just done a whole lap around the entire level. Oh, 
Let's do this drive again. Yeah, I never would have done this in the Canyon Arrow. God, what was I thinking? What? What are you thinking? Oh, sorry, Carl. Oh, shit. God, these arrows are fucking useless. Oh, thank God the mission ended there. I was worried it was going to do like... You have to get back to Frink in 20 seconds or less. Oh, God, I can't see shit with this smoke. You know what? I actually don't know if we've actually kicked Skinner or not. I don't recall kicking Skinner, so... Am I so out of touch? No. The joke. I love how his, uh, his mother is just sitting patiently in the car. Like, she's always there watching from the... Why is she in the back seat? Just get in the front, you idiot. God, he looks really, really sort of just intensely staring at me. Skinner! Aliens are distributing deadly lasers all over Springfield. We've got to warn everybody. All we've got to do, young man, is get that illicit goo goo gaw -ga out of your hands. Clearly, you forgot the school's zero tolerance policy on goo goo lasers. All right, time to kill my principal and his mother. <laughs> his old frail mother in the back. I'm about to kill you both, this 10-year-old child in a Ferrari. Wait, why did he even go to Skinner in the first place? I thought we was going back to Frink. If I had a laser, my principal would be the last person I'd go to. Oh my god, our cards merge into one. Yeah, maybe I should have got a better car for this. See, I should have got the Canyon Arrow for this one. Must kill Skinner. Wee! Must kill Skinner. Wee! Yep, that's right, I'm rehashing jokes. Yeah, well, at least that armored truck did uh, some damage to it, I guess. That's it, Skinner. Keep ramming into armored trucks. Oh god, what's happening here? That was a weird little tango we just did. But he's really just doing a lot of damage upon himself, really, isn't he? Come on, only a few more taps to go, then we're done. Fire in the hole. There we go. Well, this Skinner, uh, I'm guessing his mother just blew up. I've deprived Skinner of his mother. Hope you know that I came all this way to do this. Now all I got is my enormous gender. I mean, that's what you get for kicking the police. I mean, that's potentially what you get for staring at a policeman these days. Whee! <laughs> yeah, prize, I didn't make that. I swear to God, I've, like, done 50 laps around this entire map. All right, let's talk to Krusty again. It's a very heavy Krusty episode. Krusty, I've got proof now. See this laser gun? Well, what do you know? You cunt, you've taught this old cunt a lesson. And uh, blah, 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 etc., etc., stay in school. I just wish you told me before I let them set up those free laser gun stands. Oh, man. I better get some heavy artillery. Again, is, is Krusty the, the right person to be telling this? I mean, we've just kicked a policeman. We just kicked Louie. We should have told him. God, he's a fucking ugly child. Even in video game form, he's ugly. We all know that kid who looked like a 40-year-old man. And if you're that kid who looked like a 40-year-old man, then I'm sorry. Heavily. I'm trying to remember what episode this car's from. I'll put it on the screen. Why did you put it all the way over there? God damn it. Now I have to use my legs and walk. Oh god, I remember this mission. And I remember failing this mission a lot of times. Like, I, I've replayed this mission before using faster cars. And even with faster cars than this car, it's hard. Oh god, I'm gonna get hit and run. At this point, I don't care. Oh, for fuck's sake. Look, 14 out of 25, 45 seconds left. I think to complete this mission, you really need to remember where exactly they're placed. And everything needs to be precise and just on point. Things which I just can't do at this present time. Because I suck. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. Oh, no. No, the last one. No. God, I tried to cut I'm corners. I tried to drive from this petrol station. Or oh, for your American gas station. Okay, we're doing a lot better in, at this attempt. But I really do think we're going to get hit and run very, very soon. Yep. Way, All it took was that gentle tap of the armoured vehicle. Oh, God, now I can't see it because of the smoke. That's better. Thank you very much. Jesus Christ, go away. Oh, right. Yeah, I forgot we have to drive back. Got um. Don't think I'm gonna make this. Oh yeah, baby, bring it on! Oh my God, did you see that? <laughs> Jesus! <sighs> no, run the clown over. He's the one talking to a child. Arrest him for being a pedophile. Oh. Why didn't I just do this in the first place? Uh, why didn't I know that showgirl last night was a guy? Hindsight's always twenty twenty. And now you're talking to a child. Really not going well for you, is it, Krusty? I swear I didn't touch your daughter, and she told me <laughs> Why is it with him in this reoccurring joke? <laughs> God. Yeah, stay away from Krusty you from now on, Bart, me. I think. Hello, I fat boy. Do. Oh, God, he's dodged. Oh, Jesus he's Christ. Dead. He may be fat, but the reflexes on this guy. Oh, well, might as well say hello to Maggie. Yep, make, just making sure she's uh, still not able to breathe due to the plastic balls. Ah, got you that time, you prick. Dad. 
The aliens have taken over the Duff Brewery and they're using it to store laser guns. What? This is Duff Ice. Worst disgrace since Duff Ice. It's time to use my Duff Ice. Remember when I told you I sold my old car so you could go to college? Yeah. I lied. Where was this in the first level as well? All these characters are just keeping hold of se these secret cars. Oh wait, I'm, I'm in a race. I generally thought I was just following him. Okay, well, I should have planned this better. Oh god. We might have this. There's still a chance. No, there's no chance whatsoever. I've absolutely effed myself in the back. Oh my god, the handling in this car is absolutely shite. I do do that. I do maintain control by using the e-brakes somewhat. Right, now that I know that this is a race mission, I should be able to do it a bit better. Why don't I go the other way? God, the handling on this car is absolutely dog shite. Can we just not get back into the Ferrari? The Ferrari was is 10 times better than this car. Oh my god, I didn't even do that. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I've, I've lost. I'm not one to give up so easily, but yeah, he would have won that. I just have to rely on just um, just pure luck that other cars get in, his, get in his way. Oh, God, this car does not drive straight. It just keeps sliding everywhere. Okay, yeah, we got we got this. Easy peasy, lemony squeezy. Everyone sucks but me. Oh, there he is. <laughs> the lasers were only the beginning. Even now, our all-purpose evil cola is spreading underground through your water supply. I like it. It will wake the dead. Zombies will rise from the grave and devour the living. I like it. And our ratings will rise. Rise to levels unseen since the heyday of evening shade. I like it. Man, that sounds cool. I mean, oh no, I hope their plan fails. <laughs> Who am I kidding? Zombies eating brains? <laughs> oh, this is gonna rock. Yeah. Shut up! Is she not going to question the fact that I'm a literal donut? Oh, all right. I'll get us some beer supplies. To alcohol! Oh, the pain! Ah! Oh, great. I've got to talk to stupid Flanders. Well, might as well drive there. Drive all the way to Flanders. God damn it. Oh, I went through his wall. <laughs> I thought that was impenetrable. L Flanders, give me your first aid kit. Well, I was hoping to save it for Ryder and Todd. Shut up! You know, bandage their brain eater boo 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 boos. Look, just rub a Bible on him. Will that work to fend off zombies? That normally uh, works for me if I've got a cold or anything. Just rub the Bible on you. You'd be fine. 22 seconds to drive to Cletus's house. That's insane. Oh, shit. I've screwed myself over. Oh, I can't get back out now. God damn it. I'm trapped in Flanders' Fortress of Solitude. Oh, well, I've uh, already failed this first mission. Right, okay. Let's do this properly. Didn't even need to ask. He just said the word Flanders, and that was it. He knew what to do. Right, let's drive this piece of shit. God, I hate this car so much. Ooh, I thought I wasn't going to make that, but I did. Okay, maybe uh, the drive to Cletus' house isn't as far as I thought it would be. Oh, I'm not going to talk to him. I'm just going to steal from him. <gasps> oh my god, Mo. We have not kicked Mo yet. I need your chainsaw to chop up attacking zombies. But then how will I defend myself? I mean, his house isn't really uh, that well secured anyway. Just lock yourself in your bar. I mean, your bar is probably more well protected than uh, than your shanty settlement you have going on there. Oh, crap. Well, I think I've failed this mission. Oh, yeah, I forgot the police cars in this level are hearses. Very my chemical romance indeed. Oh, shit, I'm not going to make this tiny jump, am I? Oh, by the skin of my teeth. Another one. <laughs> I fought the law and I won as a donut. Drive to the play school playground? But why? <laughs> What's possessing me to drive there right now? I mean, shouldn't he just be protecting his family at his house? Dad, why aren't you boarding up the house? I feel like going to the school playground. Hmm, okay. That doesn't cry out red flags at all, does it? I recommend you obtain a zombie car. It will protect you well, but it runs on human brain. I got plenty of those. Homer, you're a donut. You don't have any brains. You probably have like a gelatin filling inside that little dough head of yours. Right, uh, I forgot how much it cost. Uh, how much money do I have? 91. That's not enough. <laughs> oh, god damn it. I blew all my money on this donut costume. Oh, hello, Mr. Bumblebee. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'll get back here, you bastard. Why are they so goddamn quick? <laughs> you know what this game is missing? The crazy cat lady. I would have sure loved to kick her. Oh, ho, ho, I hate the jackpot. You mean you, you would have thought with these Buzz Cola crates, they would they would probably contain Buzz Cola instead of Buzz Cola coins, right? It seems very irresponsible just to leave currency in like crates scattered everywhere around Springfield. Well, I am literally on a coin spree. Gonna be a millionaire. Oh, it's Gil. 
We haven't kicked Gil. Let's kick Gil. Don't get a lick. Doesn't Gil get a lick? Homer, stop eating yourself. That is probably like the equivalent of me just ripping my hair off and then eating it. But unfortunate news, I don't think Hans Mole Man is in this level. So, yeah, that's a bummer. No more kicking Hans Mole Man in this gameplay. Ah, oh, 80 coins away. 420 just plays. Oh, bollocks. No, no, no. I can't afford to lose 50 coins. Not now. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> well, that's uh, set me back a little bit. Come on, 10 more, 10 more, 10 more. I swear to God, if I have to buy another vehicle in this, in this level, then I'm just going to give up. I mean, not exactly a well-protected car. I mean, it hasn't even got a roof or any sides. I mean, that's just basically just advertising myself for the zombies to come eat my brains. Or all the obese people to come and eat my donut head. I mean, we all know it's going to go to uh, go to the power plant, right? I'm literally going to be driving down here and then doing the drive back again. Or because this is a mission, the car that we're going to be following is going to be driving around in circles and numerous amounts of time just to long out the mission. And then we end up in the power plant anyway. God, I think the handling on this car might be worse than Homer's sports car. <laughs> this isn't helping at all. I've just wasted 500 coins. And I've nearly got hit and run again. All right, let's follow this car to the nuclear power plant, which is on the other side of the level. Oh, crap. He bumped into me. Oh, bollocks. Well, this is a pointless car. So this level may take me longer than usual to complete. What? No, that's unfair. Come on. Eat my dust. I think we ate his dust, Homer. All right, let's try and be just careful. There's just so much shit in the way. It's hard not to ram into things. Well, it's like we're on a stakeout now. Come on. Oh, wait, no. I thought... <laughs> I thought that was the car we was following and he was just, like, stopping for no reason. God, I'm an idiot sometimes. As you know, most times I am. It's a power plant, and I'm bored of this level. Yeah, you and me both, Homer. You and me both. Nuclear. It's pronounced nuclear. Did you get that free of charge? <laughs> what is it with like doctors stealing nuclear waste? Doctor Emmett Brown stole uh, that plutonium. Oh, great. Here begins the tragic, the tragedy, which is delivering the nuclear waste to the school in a very, very short span of time. And if you were to crash into anything, the nuclear waste would explode. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> Oh, see what I mean? You know what? I'm gonna restart it. I'm not even gonna put myself through it by driving all the way back to the nuclear power plant. You're just better off restarting it if you just crash. Uh, you know what? I'm not even gonna chance going over the uh, fire truck because I know I will crash and I've gotten this far already. Oh, shit. I keep crashing into things. I am so nervous. My hand, my palms are sweaty. Well, it was nice knowing you, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just celebrating the fact that he blew up. Oh no, he survived. God damn it. I'm gonna need some more toxic waste. And some more human sacrifices. Mainly the human sacrifices. And now I'm going to the school. So <laughs> I'm just now sacrificing kids. What is Lisa doing in school? I mean, come on, man. Oh, it's a zombie apocalypse. And you've decided to come to school. And so has Ralph. I don't know what the hell Ralph was doing. I think I trod on shit. Hello. Find some nuclear waste and fast. Why don't you ask Mr. Burns? Well, duh. He couldn't it's figure that one out himself. We just delivered nuclear waste from the power plant to the school with Frink. Uh oh, it's that black car again. Oh great. There's loads of black cars on the road, Homer. Oh shit. I swear they purposely programmed the handling to be more shit if you're running away from someone. You're not just wrong, you're stupid. I blame society. Oh bollocks, yeah, I've not done this at all. <laughs> For God's sake. <laughs> oh well, I, I, th I think the cops may have helped me get away from the uh, black car. Oh god, I'm concentrating so hard. I've got 30 seconds left. I kind of don't want to be caught by the police or the funeral service, it seems, in this case. Okay, right. That's sorted. What? No! Come on! <laughs> Where's your Halloween spirit? Right, let's do the uh, let's do the climb. Oh my god, I remember doing this as a child and it took me ages. But since then, I've played many, many of platform games. So hopefully, this should be a piece of cake. Or should I say, a piece of donut. I mean, is this the only way up and down? There must be a simpler way, surely. Keep calm, Liam. Keep calm. And we made it. Ah, uh, there you are. 
Mr. Burns, so close yet so far. Shit, shit. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, really? What a very inconvenient place to put a wasp. Oh, shit. No, no, no. There we go. God damn you for having all these goddamn trap doors. And we're safely up here where no police can get us. Ooh. Hans Budkins, is it you, Merriweather? Come talk. Listen, shut up for a second. I need to get some barrels of radioactive waste to save Springfield from the aliens. I agree. Illegal aliens are a nuisance. I hope they bleed from the heart. Yeah, I'm gonna blow up instantly. Okay, I can't see due to the black smoke. Looks like my car when I'm driving and I'm vaping outside the window. It's exactly what it looks like. Yeah, but I already blew up my car. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right, let's restart the mission. I've not had to do this many restarts on a level. Right, here starts the first out of three toxic waste missions. And I'm, I'm pretty sure the last one's in Grandpa's really stupid, shitty World War II car. Why we use that car, I have no idea. God, I'm going to be, like, really silent <laughs> in these last three missions because I'm, I'm just going to be concentrating so hard not to crash and die. It was inevitable. It was bound to happen. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. There we go. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. <laughs> I need another car fast. And another human sacrifice. Yeah, Snake, he's a piece of shit. Wow, imagine me getting car- Shut up! Just go! What'll you do if I don't? I'm gonna hug you and kiss you, and then I'll never be able to let you go. Okay, don't get freaky. Get in. Well, he was surprisingly kind about that. I think we should have sacrificed Hans Mole Man. Yep, get away from the alien car again. It's just constant just lugging nuclear waste and getting away from black cars. I think they just ran out of ideas, really. And is that the last time we're going to be running away from a black car? Probably not. I can't remember. But probably not. And will I get a hit and run again? Most likely. But will I rage quit? Who knows? I could. <laughs> yep. Right, I'm actually going to go back to the nuclear power plant because I can't be bothered to do that drive again all the way from the school. This is what I feared. This is why this game is such a scary game. Dude, you better not have scratched my car. Why are you talking to me? I mean, you're the one driving, dickhead. Right, attempt two. <laughs> Next time, I'll hurt your feelings, too. Oh, no, don't do that. I love how they've put this cheerful music attached to this fucking horrible mission. <laughs> oh, do we have time to get a spanner? I don't know. I don't think we do. We'll just have to try not to crash, which is asking a lot from me. Oh, here we go. Spanner, spanner, spanner. Get the fuck out of my way. Oh, screw it. We're, we're going to have to take the shortcut. Careful, Homer. Careful, Snake. It's right there. We can see it. Goodbye, human sacrifice. Was nice knowing you, Snake. Not really. You're a fucking dickhead. Oh, I am so going to destroy you. What else exploded? Oh, here we go. We've reached a final mission, which, well, is going to be the same, but in a different car with a different person. Who wants to wager on how many times this is going to take me? I'm going to say about three at least. Where'd you get that sweet rod? Shut up! I bought it with my son. Give me a lift. I gotta save Springfield. Now you're not gonna sacrifice me for the greater good, are you, son? <laughs> we'll see, Dad. We'll see. <laughs> Poor Grandpa. Oh, God, I remember this car being a piece of shit as well. Yep, get away from the black car again. Oh, race the car to the... Oh, God damn it. Like, what difference is it gonna make if we race it, if we lose the race? Yep, I'm gonna get hit and run again. <laughs> yep, it's just to be expected at this point. Oh, my God. There goes more memories. Back in my day, we called sandwiches Black Freddy. And they caught four... This is really the perfect time to have this conversation right now. Being chased by the funeral care home society thing. We're still in first though, which is good. Oh, I didn't get uh, busted. That's very surprising. Right, that, that's not even the end of the mission because we still got to do this. Still got to collect the nuclear waste and return to the school in a minute. And um, we got far, didn't we? I could barely get there in the span of a minute and a half, let alone take 30 seconds away from that. Oh, maybe we've got to run away from a vehicle again. God damn it. A very good driver. Thanks, Homer. Oh, shit. Now I blew, blow up the car. I blew up the car. I'm confused. Let me check my underwear. Stay in your vehicle. Yeah, it's hard to do that if it explodes. Oh, God. Now we've got to race the guy again. Probably get hit and run again. This is why the last mission is so shit. I remember when this game came out and I was a little boy and I was doing this mission on my big block TV where AV cables were a thing and uh, I got to this mission 
<laughs> I crashed right at the last corner and I just shouted out the words, FUCK! Then my dad came in and took my TV. <laughs> I was grounded for two weeks. Shut up, you're not helping, Grandpa. Oh, fuck it. Uh, <laughs> oh, of all places to land, I land on a goddamn car. No! <laughs> oh, God damn it. Oh, I wish we had the car that he used in the Simpsons Road Rage, the tiny car. That would have been amazing. Would have been easier as well. How is anyone supposed to get to the school in 30 seconds? Oh, shit! I'm wedged. I can't fucking move. <laughs> this isn't happening. This is a fucking palaver. Look at that. The screen just absolutely... I, I can't move. This mission is so shit. Oh, I'm going to have to restart the goddamn mission again, aren't I? Oh, my God. You just get hit. You get hit and run so easily in this uh, this level. Oh, come on. Just If you're going to respawn me, respawn me in the right goddamn direction. Oh, shut up. Please. For once in your life, just shut up. Oh, fuck. How the hell did I do that? Right, don't blow up the car, don't blow up the car, don't blow up the car, don't blow up the car. This bar takes ages to go down. I really don't know how anyone is able to complete this. I don't even know how I was able to complete this as a child. Oh, God. Oh, for fuck's sake, really? Oh, no. <laughs> this is just an endless loop of me screwing this mission up. We were so close yet so far, again. Oh god, why did I have this great idea in my head to go back to this goddamn game? Yeah, Liam, playing Simpsons Hit and Run is going to be a great idea. Be very nostalgic. Yep, hit and run yet again. Fuck me. I'm not even going to reach the fucking power plant. I'm not even going to reach the fucking power plant. No! <laughs> Fuck me! Yeah, this isn't going to happen. <laughs> I'm gonna get hit and run any minute now. Yep, there it is. There we go, there's the famous hit and run. Yep, and there goes the nuclear waste. There goes another 50 coins out of my pocket. And there goes the car, fuck me. You aren't gonna put me back in the home, are you? So I have to go back to my home planet now, uh, where I'm needed in the planet donut. <laughs> came from another planet and then it just it turns out homer went back to his home planet and abraham simpson uh, did did the whole thing he, he completed the whole mission by himself and that was that that was the end so i hope you've enjoyed watching me play the simpsons hit and run it's been it's been a journey and i hope you've enjoyed being on this journey with me uh, why, why are there zombies crowding around me now i don't even know anyway don't forget to like and subscribe it really helps me out a lot and we'll see you next tuesday shut up yeah, we ran out of patience!